What up, what up? Man, I'm back at it. I know I've been slacking on the videos, I ain't gonna lie, but that's just because I haven't really been, uh, I haven't been receiving any parts or nothing lately. Uh, things have just been taking a minute, but uh, I'm here today to do a video uh, on the 300. I told you guys I was gonna start building it. So I got these uh, carbon fiber side skirts. I didn't even notice this shit got fucked up. Uh, yeah, so I got these carbon fiber side skirts that I'm about to install. That's an actual mold, that's not a layover. But I got this today because uh, I, I'm pretty sure nobody has this done. This is like a one on one. Uh, even the side skirts, I'm pretty sure nobody really fucking has any on a 300. But uh, today, I'll be doing a video on this. So I got these custom made out in Cali. They just got shipped in yesterday. Uh, I opened them up. I haven't even like, I haven't even uh, opened them up like the box or nothing. I just got it in. I made sure I charged, you know, my camera and I got to it. So uh, let me show you guys real quick. This is the package. And this is what came in. So, uh, I'm going to take the rest of this shit off. And, uh, and then I'm going to wrap it. And I'm going to get it installed. I'm going to do a video on this. But what y'all think? What do you think it is? I'm pretty sure most of y'all know what it is. But, yeah, like I said, I haven't seen no 300 SRT or no 300 S whatever with carbon fiber of this. So uh, let me get to it. So I got uh, the parts loaded up. Surprisingly, they fit in the car. But uh, let me give you guys an update. I don't think I've gave you guys an update since last time. So I did the 2015 or whatever, uh, 2014 or no, yeah, the 2015 front bumper uh, conversion. Looks a lot better. I still got to get got it painted, but it looks a lot better. Um, I got the OEM wheels on. I still got the welds in the back, but I'm gonna be getting rid of those. I'm gonna keep the OEMs though. But this shit, look at this. I got a lot. Of, this is a project car, bro. Project car, straight up. I had this thing for like five, six years. Didn't really like just let it sit, honestly, but. Now it's a, now it's a project, but uh, let's get in this shit. Let's start heading out. It's dirty as hell in here, bro. But I did also get a new floor mats. Those should be coming in today as well. But locked and loaded, we'll be straight. About to pump, um, about to bump that new Drizzy. You know what I'm saying? With my boy Drizzy Drake. About to bump that. I'm not gonna put that in the video because then they fucking put that bullshit on the video for bumping his music and shit. I'm trying to get paid too, Drizzy. Shit. Get copyrighted. But I'm gonna start heading out. I'm gonna go get the shit installed. I'm gonna unwrap them. I'm gonna show you the video of them getting unwrapped, installed, and how it looks. It's right out. Here it is. So I ain't gonna lie, quality's good on these. I ain't gonna lie. It looks pretty good. Nice smooth finish. I mean, I can't really, looks good. Doesn't really have any lifts. I like it. I don't really see too many. Oh, I can see some imperfections in it, but it's not bad. So we're gonna get them installed. We'll be back on it. All right, we're back at it. We're gonna, Get the fenders installed. 
But these are the OEM. As you can tell, the paint is rough on this shit. I gotta get that fixed too. Uh, you see the hood. Like I said, I, neg I neglected this car a lot, so. And this happened. I was at the gym, getting gains, getting buff as fuck. Somebody, I opened my door and some old guy, oh shit. Fucking smoky. Uh, opened the door and somebody hit it, so I gotta get this fixed too. The roof has to get fucking fixed. So there's a lot I gotta do to this car, but I'm gonna show everybody the build. Uh, I should have did that with my Jeep, but we're gonna do it with this one for sure. So we're gonna get to start taking off the bumper and everything and get everything assembled. And I'll show you. All right, so we got the the fender off. You got a couple bolts I showed you in the video over there. That what bolts you have, and then you have a bolt inside here. And then you got uh, bolts underneath the side skirt. And you got the little rivets as well. It's like down there. I'm not gonna get down there, but so you know. So now we're gonna get the driver's side installed. Should be good to go. All right, so we just got done installing the, the driver's side fender. Well, actually both of them. This is how it came out. That's like a one-on-one. Ain't no one have that shit. Ain't no one have that, I swear. This coming along looks badass. And that's in the shade. You already got the, I got the trunk. This is the passenger side. So, I'm gonna put back everything and then I'll go in the sun and show the results. But these are the fenders, one on one. Those are the old ones. Just gotta throw the bumper on and we're good to go. All right, <clears throat> so we got the fenders installed. This is how it looks. So that's it. I'll post another video here soon. The fenders are like an OEM fitment. That's the driver's side. Uh, they're like an OEM fitment. They're good. Everything came out good. Um, so this is basically the winter project. I know you can't really see them that good in the sun, but that's because it's cold as fuck outside. But this will be it. I'm working on it. Uh, I'll do another video here next week or so. I got some more carbon fiber that I'll be installing on the car. But uh, there it is, the carbon fiber fenders, one on one.